Hey guys, what is up? A very warm welcome back to my channel. Now, the title of this video is going to rub a couple of people up the wrong way because I know you have those people who are stuck in their over ear only club and they're not gonna be able to understand even doing this kind of comparison. But seeing as for me, it actually happened in real life, it is possible. What am I talking about? Well, a few weeks ago, Sony released their brand new WH-1000XM fours gosh it's a long product name and these were an upgrade to what was already an incredibly high-end set of noise cancelling headphones i went to my local tech store to try them out and to be honest i was very impressed the material used here produce much more of a premium finish and of course when it comes to sound and noise cancelling they're right up there but instead of leaping for these what did i do I went and bought the Apple AirPods Pro. Now, I know there's a bit of a price difference here, and so you might be wondering how I can even compare the two, but in this case, for me, price was not a relevant factor. I was happy to pay the difference if I decided, in the end, to go for the XM4s. So yes, I picked the AirPod Pros on merit, and here's five reasons why. First, convenience. When it comes to size, portability, and charging on the go, the AirPod Pros really are hard to argue with. They come in this tiny little portable, kind of dental floss-like case, which gives you 24 hours battery life. Obviously, on one charge, you get three and a half hours, but for my use case, that's perfect. And a 15-minute charge gets you three hours of use. Number two, integration. Because I own Apple devices like the MacBook Pro, iPad Pro, iPhone XS Max, the AirPods fit so well into this ecosystem and they honestly switch between devices so easily. There really is hardly any friction involved. Even when it comes to pulling out and pausing what you're actually watching or listening to, it all works as well as we would expect on an Apple device. Number three, the noise cancelling. Now yes, an over-ear noise cancelling headphone is always going to have the upper hand when it comes to noise cancelling ability. But for me, you do get about 70 to 75% of your noise cancelling ability in something that is drastically smaller. So for me, it hits the sweet spot on being able to get that noise cancelling, but not have to lug around something that is too big. And on my recent trip to Greece, which was a three hour flight, they really do so well at blocking out the jets and creating a little bubble for you to consume your media inside of. Number four, microphone quality. Of course, we're now transitioning into the days of working from home, so we on a whole lot more video and conference calls, even when it comes to our personal lives as well. And so we've really gotten to understand the importance of having a good quality microphone for these calls, not for us, but for the person on the other end of the line. And when it comes to crisp sounding microphones, I personally give the AirPods Pro the upper hand. And lastly, a reason that's not a single reason in itself, but simply because of all of these factors together, I will be using them a whole lot more. And I think that's a key point. It's all very well having a Rolls Royce parked outside your home, but if it's not practical to get into the car to go and zip to get some groceries, what's the point of having it? And that's the same phenomenon here. Realistically, with the over ears, I would only be using them at home or for long haul flights of maybe five hours or more because I don't want to be carrying them around me all the time. Whereas with my AirPods, I'll take them to gym, to work, to the mall, or anywhere I'm going if there's even just the slightest possibility that I'll need them for just one minute or more because they really do sit in this little dental floss type case. So that's why I picked up the AirPod Pros over the Sony XM4s and I'd like to know what your thoughts are. Which one would you go for? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.